Thank you for tuning in with Enchantress, that's me, the Babbler, that's me, on this evolutionary uprise of a high rise at this time. And so, guided by spirit, I was actually going to pull one animal spirit oracle card to share on this channel. And then, of course, I grab the sexual magic tarot cards and a story begins to unfold. So I didn't continue to shuffle because I went with the one card that was already pulled. If you've been tuning in, then you already know. So leaving off from wherever the story last was told. This is the first card that came out into awareness. And kind of even in thinking in this state of current space. Something's being left out, and this is an intuitive read, so everything is about the female divine here, where he's kind of like hovering over, like blocking something. And then here, if you look out into the distance, there's something, but I kind of think that's more of a mental processes or something that is just not being shared. That should. Can you see? Can you see? The hidden things that exist behind the veil. And it's kind of like he knows that she's intuitive and can pick this shit up. So it's like intentionally being over the top, kind of. Over the top, as in. The depiction in this picture he's over the top over her so that she don't see that that's being left out kind of thing still some third party karmic kind of like omitting something that still should be said because one wants to still wear one mask of pretend so what's up with that like that's what i see intuitively oh yeah it's about she but there's still some other things lurking in the deep this story as it unfolds it's like somebody's still being a creep like that's creep like egoic behavior and then justice comes out and she's like hmm Okay. <laughs> you want to play? Things that I don't know. We see. We see all things. We balance everything out. Here are all the elements. You see water. You see earth. You see her. Nakedness and yet reserved nature. To. With. Life. She's even wearing the color of blue. True. The sky representing air. Justice shall prevail. So this I heard a lot of things just with strength coming out here. The strength she has to tame the beast, his inner beast. It's not a beast that she's getting infused, you see, or being brought to the surface so that one can see. Instead of living in self denial, deception, you see, when you wear many masks and do not allow yourself to simply be or acknowledge the parts of you that are pieces of you that make up an entire whole and instead, like, hide behind every single mask. Like, the triggers that are coming out for that to be attacked it's like love unconditional love catering to every single part of the beast that is battling itself because it doesn't look like he's attacking her there it looks like he's fighting the earth <laughs> two more I uh, see the, the queen of pentacles and he devoted to she shows up here she sits upright her crown adjusted 
perfectly on the top of her head. Foot fetish, possibly, here in the lovers. Pressure being the ground that she walks on, but, you know, this is all intuition based that one may know, but there's still something being left out there in the code. Some truth yet to be shown, acknowledged, shared, released. But here we are met by the sun, an outcome that can be fun and done when someone takes the actions and steps needed to, you know, deliver the justice that is needed. See, there's only, there's only so many times one can get bailed out by the universe, by the divine and still never learn the lessons that they're meant to learn at this time, which is why the cycle keeps on going round and round and round. So here it's coming up because love is finally found, like the unconditional acceptance that each has for the other is to surrender in that state of vulnerability and feel that safe pleasure that can be obtained. I always say the cornucopia it's here the sun right here xx unified and fusion that reminds me of just like the dna lines these are progression these are steps that are taken just as this here but you know there's a lot of like things that still need to be established and made clear here we don't always got a lot to say and still kind of <coughs> <coughs> leaving something out. Maybe her. Maybe she's getting left out. Maybe that's exactly the thing because he's there stuck on this image from a distance, from afar. Like thoughts constantly spiral out to what can't be let go of. but won't be made known either because there's something being left out. Look at twice. Something being left out that she should know that he has yet to say. It's not about the team. It's about the vulnerability and the trust. And she offers it to he. Will he accept? The potential can always be the potential. But until one does what one needs to do. Potential is like drawing a picture. Just to have its abstract. And its imagery and call it just a dream. There's so much to look forward to and have once whatever's left out is brought to the surface and made clear. Bringing forward the death of something that kind of like cock blocks to something from emerging because it serves no purpose yet to just cause unnecessary grief and strife and taunting, you know, mental strife and lies that come from cycles that repeat that are unhealthy and not <coughs> necessarily true. The death of the egoic you birthing something new. Thank you for tuning in. I am going to end it there, my friends. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also tune into enchantingbabble.blogspot.com. And make sure to follow me too on 
Instagram at Enchantress, E-N-C-H-A-N-T-R-E-S-S. -S. Thank you. Come again. And.